It's your boy, Richie Ruckus. We are back here today. It is Thursday, January 18th, a.k.a. Air Max 98 Gundam release day. Sadly, this video is not a review of them sneakers, but it is an unboxing, review, and on feet of a different pair of Nikes that I was able to cop in yesterday's vlog. Before we jump into this unboxing, two quick things. One, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed to my channel. Make sure you hit that thumb up if you're feeling this video. And follow your boy on all social. Number two, the Richie Ruckus Sneaker Things Seinfeld Tee is dropping on February 1st at 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. RichieRuckus.com. They're arranging from a size small to a size 5X. They'll be retailing for $20 and I do ship internationally. I went to the mall for a totally different reason. I actually wasn't even there to grab sneakers in the first place. I mean, I was doing my usual perusing and hitting every sneaker store. And then I was leaning towards grabbing the Vapor Max OG, that pure platinum and red colorway that they got out that I was unable to attain a few weeks ago when I grabbed the Sprite Vapor Max. Then I seen these. All bets were off. I had to grab these. These guys know the drill. Let's get a glimpse of these board locks. We got that Nike Vapor Max and that Fly Knit Digi Camo. These are so, so dope. I love olive. You guys know that. The infrared on the heel and then the infrared Vapor Max branding on the back are nice, subtle touches, as well as the infrared Nike logo on the tongue and then the infrared Vapor Max branding on the insole. I already have a pair of olive Vapor Maxes and I try not to double up in colorways, but these are fire. Like, these may be my favorite Vapor Maxes. I didn't even know these were out. I went finish line, kicks, foot action, champs, and then I just walked the foot locker at this mall over at Deptford in New Jersey. It's kind of like off the grid from everything else. And I just popped in there and had these sitting in the glass case. These are fire. It just, words cannot describe how dope these sneakers are. You got hints of dark olive, hints of light olive. That digital camo print on the back of the heel coming along the upper to damn near the front of the sneaker. You got that classic Nike flying it throughout the upper. Just a dope, dope sneaker. The price point is a little weird. These are $195 opposed to the usual $190 it is for a Vapor Max. Like the Vapor Max Mach were $200, the multicolor drawings that I got. And then the Chuckas were $225. The Utilities are $220. Just weird, the price point of just making us $5 more, I guess, for the camo print. The only thing I will say, if these had an olive airbag, they would be untouchable as far as just their dopeness. But the clear airbag I can get behind, that's pretty much it, guys. We're going to go do an on-foot look, and then I'll be back tomorrow with Niaja's unboxing of her sneakers she picked up yesterday's vlog. But until then, I'm Richie Ruckus. Peace. Play this record as frequently as possible. She rock his beat. Holla. Richie Walker's beat.